Welcome to another episode of Conversations with Clarissa. Coming to you live from the prayer closet. Um, today I wanted to talk about the stripping labels cards that I created and just kind of give some backstory. So back in 2023, I started attending Victory City Church and after I got baptized, I was told about a marriage class that they had. And so my husband and I started attending this class with Michael and Coloma, shout out to them. And during the class, we started learning about pain cycles and peace cycles and different ways of communicating with your partner. And one of the things that we learned about is knowing who God says that you are. And during that class, I started to question what God said that I was and what specific things that I needed to apply to my own life that God said that I was. So I started researching it and looking it up and trying to figure out like, what does God say that I am? And throughout the journey of doing this research, I started writing all the things that God said that I was and which came up with the stripping labels um, idea because I started realizing throughout the years, I've put on so many labels that society has put on me, um, such as being mean or angry or aggressive or not a good person. Um, a disappointment, uh, just anything that someone had said that I was in the past. And I put that label on because I believed it to be true about myself. But in the class, I learned that the things that we should know to be true about ourselves is whatever God says that we are. And so I started looking for what God says that I was. And so the stripping labels is basically um, everything that God says that we are. This is what they look like. I have um, different uh, things in here that says what God says that you are. Um, like I am God's child. Um, I am made new. Uh I am loved, different things that God says that I am and um, that I am forgiven. So I don't have to carry that shame. And on each card, it also has the scripture that correlates with whatever it says that God says that you are. Um, just so that you don't have to go doing the searching for those scriptures. Um, I will say throughout going through the Bible myself and looking for these scriptures, it definitely increased my intimacy with God. Um, and knowing what he says about me, it helps keep me rooted and grounded on who I truly am because so often we can take on these labels that society has put on us instead of just taking on the labels that God put on us and who he says that we are. And I had to learn to stay rooted and grounded in what he says instead of let a society tell me who I am and let God tell me who I am. And I hope that you can get these cards for yourself and that they can help you um, have peace and know that you are loved and know that Jesus loves you and know that you're his masterpiece and that you're beautiful and you're wonderful, fearfully and wonderfully made. I hope that with these cards that you can learn what God's word says that you are that and that you are here for a purpose and that he is going to guide you in everything that you do. And we cannot do this without him. You are able to find peace and happiness. And please inbox me if you want to copy or visit the website and we can ship them out to you. Uh, just click the link in the description in order to get it. Or you can inbox me on Love Fearlessly 3 on Instagram and at Love Fearlessly on Facebook. Thank you and we'll see you again next time.